The quickest and easiest way to assign knobs and faders on your MIDI controller with plugins, instruments, and other parameters in Logic is to use automation quick access. Let me show you how to do this. You go up to Logic Pro settings and then go to automation. From this dialog at the bottom, you'll see an option that says automation quick access. Click learn message and then slowly turn a continuous controller on your MIDI controller. Once you've done that, click done and close the dialog. So what automation quick access does is it automatically assigns the continuous controller with the active automation parameter on the selected track. So right now it's volume, so you can see it's controlling volume. If I switch this over to pan, now it's gonna control pan. And if I were to change this over to a parameter within the Tremolo plugin, now I'm controlling the depth knob within the Tremolo plugin automatically without having to even open the controller assignments dialog. What's even better is when you pair this with the auto select automation parameter in read mode option under the mix menu. So turn this on, and if you simply click on a parameter within a plugin or instrument, it will now show up as the active automation parameter on that track, and you can have quick and easy access to it. If I want to adjust the rate, just click on the rate. Now I have control of the rate. Click on smoothing. Now I have control of the smoothing and so forth and so on. And then you can just turn on a live automation mode like touch or latch and write in any automation you like.